Properly fitted skates are essential for the comfort and support of the foot and critical for the performance of the athlete. Okay, Abby, first thing we're going to do is measure your feet in both a seated and a standing position. So let's take off your shoes. Place your right foot on this sizing stick. Lift up your toes. Okay, now I'm going to have you stand up and put your weight down on that one, please. Okay, have a seat. Let's take the left foot. Lift up your toes, put them down flat. Okay, and I'm going to have you stand up and put your weight down on that. Very good, thank you. Okay, great. Now we're going to measure you out for the width of your skate. I'm going to wrap your tape around the ball area of your foot, put down, and we'll pull the tape snug and measure that. I'm going to take it at the, ace, the waist area, measure that, both right and left feet. And now, with the length of your foot and the width that I've determined here, if you take a look at the width card, you measure it on a size 6, then you're at 8 inches, so you would be approximately an A width on your skate. First thing you're going to do is open up the back of the boot to allow your foot to be able to get inside the skate, back in the heel a little bit easier. Pull the tongue forward, slide the foot inside the skate. Okay, pull the tongue up. I'll lightly tap your foot flat on the ground. There you go, get all the way down. Let's kick your heel back. Good, place your foot up here. Now place the tongue inside the skate and make sure it's in the center of the leg. Start with the laces all the way down at the throat area while keeping even, snug tension. When you get to the ankle, make sure that the tongue is tucked in on both sides of the ankle. Cross your laces over and go over the tops of the hooks here and cross over and pull from side to side. That allows the boot to wrap around the ankle and take a nice shape into the ankle joint. Tie off the lace. Make sure the pressure is the same equal amount. That would be the correct size for you. Now when you unlace your skates, you want to make sure that you unlace the skates, pull the laces out as far that will allow without having the lace come out of the lace hole and keep the opening the same. Open them down over the tops of the toes into the throat area of the skate. Pull the tongue forward. When you do that, it allows the foot to come out of the skate much more easily. And then when you go back skating again, your foot will go into the skate a lot easier when you go skating next time.